with another banger. We're going to be talking about Dogecoin, ticker symbol D-O-G-U-S-D, on the road to a dollar. It finally broke that 10 cents level. You guys know I wanted to have my big position here. We're going to go over that. Support levels, buying levels, new resistance levels as Dogecoin is starting to push up. Again, try not to get FOMO around this time because I feel like we will get some decent pullbacks on Dogecoins. I don't think it's just going to be going crazy like here. Remember this move that we had on Dogecoin? It kind of just shot up. It always came back down to buy a better pricing, came back down to buy a better pricing. And then, of course, you know, we had that big pull down. So just be mindful of that. Try not to get any FOMO on the road to a dollar. That's what I'm holding for. You guys know that. And I'll give you guys some new levels on Dogecoin. Ticker symbol D-O-G-U-S-D. Smash the like button. Subscribe if you are new. Let's get the video over 50 likes. If you guys want another Dogecoin, maybe later tonight, I might update you guys on Dogecoin if these levels break that I'm about to give you or tomorrow, okay? But smash the like button, get the video right there, uh, 50 likes. Make sure you watch the video before this one on Shiba Inu. Going to the moon, buy now. If you wanted levels on Shiba Inu, um, what I'm looking at, make sure you watch the videos right before this one, okay? So Dogecoin, we had a support level, buying level, resistance level. Let's zoom in a little bit, okay? And then we'll put all the new levels on there. Support level hold, price never came back down there. Good. Buying level where I want to see buying pressure at, it almost hit it here, okay? And I was about to buy Dogecoin. It did not hit it, so I didn't buy. Full disclosure, I did not buy Dogecoin. I already have Dogecoin from Dogecoin dropping here. This one I was buying, okay? So now that we're up here, I don't feel FOMO like I need to buy it because I was buying it when it was going down. That's the key point, okay? So support level is going to move up. Buying pressure is going to move up. Something else I really don't like, I don't like the steepness of it, right? It's like this. Usually that presents a bigger down movement, okay? I'd rather it build how it was building like this. It was going up, down, came down here, stalled out, came up there, then had a bigger pullback here. That is the move that I like seeing. This presents a lot of strength. But this right here, I just rather it build slowly, build strong, not just shoot up quickly because just as fast as it goes up, it could come down just much faster. So that's something I'm watching out for. That's why I'm trying not to get FOMO and try to buy here. I'd rather have a little pull down. So let's go ahead and go over all these levels. This is Dogecoin, ticker symbol DOG, on the road to a dollar. And let's take this off. Now, something else I want to tell you guys before I give you guys levels is Dogecoin is actually moving good off of no big news, right? Big news is like Elon saying, okay, we're accepting Dogecoin on Twitter now. That's huge news, right? I like how it is moving right now. This is presenting a lot of strength. Be careful because Dogecoin is going to be pushing. So we want to be watching out for that. Make sure you guys use code 10 last. 10 last. You get 10% off when you join the team. It's the first thing in the description to get all my buys and sells for crypto. So you want to know when I buy Dogecoin, join the team. First thing in the description. This code will end on Tuesday and then price is going to go up before you join. Okay, so make sure you use that code 10 last to join the team. So resistance levels. I'm going to drag the levels up first and then I'm going to give you guys um, the... Uh, the uh, I'm gonna write it out. So buying level, <sighs> buying level. I'm gonna put buying level here for now. Um, I'm gonna put it like here at about 99. There, support is actually down here, so we do have a lot of room to kind of pull down. Um, actually, I'm gonna put buying level down here. We do have a lot of room to pull down, so price on Dogecoin could put all the way down back here. To around nine cents even and i'll still be shorter term bullish so just know if it does pull all the way down here that's still fine because our support is very low which is actually kind of good so i'm glad it's breaking the resistance levels holding the supports that's going to present a lot of bullishness so like i said smash the like button let's get the video over 50 likes if you guys do that then i could probably update you guys later on um today if these levels break so let me put the support level so new support is 0.09 even 0 0.09 even so nine cents buying level is 0 0.095 so nine cents and a half and then resistance level all the way up here is about 11 cents 50 i'm about 11 50 right here so resistance is very high we do have some smaller resistance but i feel like this is the bigger resistance that might tend to have us some pullback so just in case dogecoin keeps shooting up you want to be patient and you want to watch this level here because that's where we're probably going to get a resistance and then we're going to pull down and then we could possibly buy at cheaper prices to continue that price going higher. Now, like I told you guys, I'm going to give you guys a significant level probably in the next Dogecoin video. If Dogecoin passes that Pacific level, we'll probably see Dogecoin back up to the 20 cents to the 30. So between like 20, 25 cents, we'll probably see it going. But for right now, 
these are the main levels I see on Dogecoin. Yes, I own Dogecoin. Yes, looking to buy more. And yes, holding to that dollar mark. So let's get it going. DOG USD. Thank you guys for watching the video. Subscribe, smash the like button. And like I said, if anything changes, if even if Dogecoin like comes down here, right? Say it gets a buying pressure level and it breaks, that's okay because we still have a support down here, right? So I can still buy at the support. We just want to see where support is going to hold. Right now, it's very sharp on the upside movement. So be mindful that we could see some pullback in this area here. Um, and then I'll update you guys probably later today as Dogecoin is moving faster. You might need a little more updates faster too. So always remember, no recommendation to buy or sell anything. This is for educational purposes only. So do not trade anything you see or hear in the video. I'll catch you guys in that next one. Bye.